Hi, and welcome to the show, coming to you this month from Seattle Museum of the Mysteries. Now, this is the place you come to learn everything there is to know about Sasquatch, AKA Bigfoot, and other cool Northwest mysteries. We've got some great stuff to show you. Local actor, writer, Matt Smith is on tap with a look at his newest show, My Boat to Bainbridge, and we'll start with the phenomenal art program at Elderwise. This is what I thought we might paint today. I can be surprised by what turns up. The blue's great. Our mission at Elderwise is to transform the culture of aging. We have a passion for aging. I've been teaching at Elderwise for six years, teaching painting, and the reason it keeps me coming back and it's always alive every day is the participants. I would take the yellow from the top to start with and make, make it all yellow. Painting is really important because it helps our awareness. We've made cards of the paintings to help encourage the participants to respect what they can do and say, aha, I did that. When people come in and see the work at Grateful Bread or any other venue that we have, I really hope that you know, certain paintings draw people and give them hope and a smile and a sense of well-being. All drive on passengers, please return to the auto deck at this time. Walk on passengers, we'll disembark the vessel via the overhead walkway. Bainbridge Island. The piece is called My Boat to Bainbridge. It's about a man who lives in Seattle and does not want to leave for a life in the suburbs. This is my town. This is it. This is Seattle. My dad grew up here. My mom grew up here. They were both born here. My dad had parking lots for the Seattle World's Fair. It's about really nothing special. Nothing really happens. But it's about how even to make a very small transformation is profound. We go upstairs and there's people streaming onto the boat. Like hundreds, hundreds of people are streaming onto the boat. And, and I don't know why they're there. And it turns out that Janine has made an appointment with a real estate agent. To, a real estate agent. This seems overwhelming to me, and I become absolutely overstimulated by the, the meaning of this, and I go, into a, I go into, a, into a spirit state. I like it kind of as a lunch bucket kind of performance, where you go in and uh, something happens, but it's, not, it's not, nothing special that you can put your finger on. But perhaps certain stories will waft over you over the next week and gradually help settle in your way of thinking and feeling about the world. And now for the details. Ooh. Check out the beautiful Elderwise artwork all this month at The Grateful Bread. Call 525-3166 for hours and directions. Also, mark your calendar for the Elderwise annual September exhibit at the Allegro Cafe located in the U District. Catch Matt Smith in My Boat to Bainbridge Friday nights at 8 p.m. at the Market Theater located in Seattle's Pike Place Market. More information is at unexpectedproductions.org. Local DJ Alex Reuter spins a tasty and eclectic mix of music Thursday mornings from 8 till 10 and Monday evenings from 5 till 7 only on Rainy Dog Radio, the UW station run entirely by UW students. Tune Alex in online at rainydog.org. And finally, it's spring, it's May, it's SIF. The 2005 Seattle International Film Festival kicks off May 19th and runs through June 12th. A full film schedule is available at seattlefilm.com. Miss something? Not to worry. Go to seattlechannel.org. Capitol Hill's Seattle Museum of the Mysteries to your must-visit list. For directions and hours, call 328-6499. And that's it for the show. Thanks for watching. As always, we encourage you to get out there, try something new, and experience the awesome and mysterious power of art. We'll see you next time.